Hi, I'm Sumati for PharmacyG.net. In this tutorial, we are going to create some glass bottle with Blender, and I'm using my latest Ubuntu Studio version, my laptop. And you can see it is a 64-bit version, and it is a lot faster than my previous Windows installation. You can and uh, compare compare that with uh, my Windows and Ubuntu Studio version in my blog PharmacyG.net. So let us start with Blender. And how to blender version. This is the original blender version downloaded from blender.org, and this is the test build. So it contains a lot of functionality than my stable blender version. So I'm just using uh, the SVN build blender. Okay. So it is blender 2.6 H. So we are presented uh, with a default cube and light camera first of all i'm just going to enable screen cast key so you can see what is happening in blender so this is the default scene we are going to delete our this cube and also the light so there is one camera left in the front view add a mesh cylinder and increase its depth to 6 you can see and uh, now we have a cylinder and just turn on the smooth shading and also we need to add the draw all edges and where so we can see what is happening with the edges um, when we are going to edit this first of all i am going to rename it to bottle it is best to start with saving the scene so file save it will ask for a save and a new directory named blast bottle so just save it as plus bottle just save blender scene and we are going to modify it to a glass bottle so first jump to edit mode press tab uh, this is a fancy icons you can get with uh, the svn build from blender.org or from graphical or website so just select the edit mode press a deselect that go to the wireframe mode and use loop cut and slide so we have a middle loop cut here just increase the number of cuts to six so we have a cylinder with lot of edge cuts here first of all we need to shape it so select the bottom vertices uh, the last one second last one just move it downward like this deselect that press b and just scale the bottom vertices like this and also deselect b select or downward just close enough to this and we can select these vertices just move it upward to the center and select these group of vertices scale z axis scale down like this just move it upward and select these vertices scale it downward like this and also top vertices scale like this little bit like this so we have something like a bottle so it is the base uh, for the bottle you can see now what we need to do is to add some smoothness uh, this is very sharp for a bottle 
so we need some more smoothness to it first of all i'm just going to add some distortion for the border list now just looking a perfect cylinder at the center so select this and reduces just scale a little bit down like this and with this selection on press and uh, select uh, the edge mode so all these vertices are convert to edge press press ctrl b so that will activate the bevel just scale and uh, drag upward without clicking like this and you can see there is segment option just increase the segment to 5 okay that's just perfect and that will add some edge loops here and now this is smooth enough for a base bottle version and also select select just two of them press ctrl e edge loop that will select the edge loop press ctrl b just press ctrl b for b well and just move a little bit like this so we will get some sort of um edge loop here just decrease the segment so uh, this will add some more what is us here and also we need to add one look cut here so just use edge look cut and slide that will be perfect and just scale it little bit like this and press ctrl b and just scale at some edges here so we have a perfect smooth bottom and also we need to add the same procedure for this area also so select any of this ctrl e h loop ctrl b for b well and just increase it a little bit higher also segment two three four five that will be enough you can also use one more command here that is smooth vertices so just press and that uh, will smooth this area a little bit and spread our vertices a little bit upward and also select any edge here ctrl e edge loop ctrl b do the same like this okay so uh, you can also have this area also ctrl e edge loop ctrl b like this and also decrease the segment so we have perfect bottle uh, you can um, add some more bevel or any edge cut here but uh, this is just perfect for this section so just skip to the object mode for that just move it a little upward just place it here and use origin origin to 3d cursor that will place the origin to the base of uh, the grid to the cylinder and now we have our glass bottle here just save and what we need to do is now it is not like a bottle uh, just the base is there we need more tweaking here first of all we need some sort of um, thickness here before that i'm just going to apply a material to this and just change change it to cycle render and you need to add a material here just new material we have a diffuse material just rename it to glass and change the diffuse to glass bsdf just turn on the render tab so we can see now it is just looking like a glass bottle but uh, there is no thickness or anything and you can see there is a little bit edge darkness here so we need a more smoother version so we need first we need to do is to add some modifier so add modifier there is one click called subdivision surface and that will perfectly add some more faces here so you can see perfect smooth 
a looking glass but there are some problems here and at the bottom area or so you can see so what is causing that is just jump back to solid mode you can see and now you have a flower mesh at the bottom and also at the top so we need to remove this so first I jump back to edit mode so you can see and just turning off this and what we need to do is select go to the face mode select the top and also this bottom face and simply delete this face jump back to object mode add the subdivision surface so that will add a subdivision surface like this so now we get rid of that problem and just press apply that will apply the subdivision and what we need to do is just go to edit mode we need to fill this hot so jump to edge mode select only the bottom edge control e edge loop then press f that will fill that hole jump to the render mode now you can see now the bottom is just perfect um, and there is no flower mesh and all this area is just smooth enough and but still it is not like a glass bottle because we don't have any thickness so we need to add a thickness for this so in order to do that just jump back to our solve mode and in the modifier tab add another modifier named solidify that will add some thickness to this area so just increase the thickness to 0.7 i think not 0.7 just 0 0.07 that will add a, a thickness to our bottle so you can see now our bottle have much thickness and if i render again you can see now our glass is just looking perfect and in the solid models can just watch here this bottom area also uh, there is a little bit thickness here we need to increase that first so just in the solid mode maybe you can jump to edit mode so now um, this solidify section is not editable so what we need to do is first apply that if we are in the edit mode just pressing apply won't do the modifier to the object jump back to object mode just press apply that will apply to the mesh and in the edit mode jump to the edit mode and in the f just uh, deselect that and in the face mode simply select and uh, inner bottom face and just just a little bit upward like uh, this so that will add some inner section so if we jump to rendered mode you can see now there is some sort of segment here and there is a lot of weak maybe in the wireframe mode just like okay not that much so we have something like this we just model our glass bottle and you can see this area is too much sharp so in the edit mode select these top edges and press ctrl e edge loop press ctrl b for bevel and you can see now it's just beveling and what can we can do is just press more 26 as so so that will add some more smoothness at the top section jump to the ranged mode you can see now it's a lot smoother than before and this concludes the section of 
glass blow till creation in blender in the next part we will discuss about the lighting techniques of this kind of effect and of course in that part we will add some water to this bottle maybe some colored water so keep watching from ecg.net